younger, did you ever come to know an individual by the name of Jeffrey Williams? Yeah. How long have you known Jeffrey Williams? Uh, I'm not good with time. Alexander. Since we was kids. About how old were you when you first met him? I can't remember the age. Was as far it, as I can remember, I knew him. Do you believe it's why you were in elementary school, middle school, or something else? <clears throat> Mm, I, ain't, I I've been knew him. I can't. Okay. How did y'all? Before meet? I knew him, I knew of him. Put it like that. I knew his family members before I knew him. What? Which family member did you know before you knew him? His mom, his dad, his sisters. How did you know his mom, his dad, and his sisters? I can't remember which one of them, but they stayed in my my apartments. I don't know if it was his mom and dad, but they stayed in my apartment. I just never seen him. I always seen his brothers and sisters. And is, did they stay in your apartments at Gilbert Gardens? Yeah. And since you first saw his family before you met him, did you have any type of relationship with his family members? Um, no, I was a kid. It was just they had the basketball court. Yeah. <clears throat> Now, do you call him Jeffrey Williams? Huh? Do you call him Jeffrey Williams? When you refer to him, do you I call him? I don't call him? nobody by their whole name. Okay. What did you call him? Lil' Jeff. Anything else? I just call him a lot of names. He's a lot of nicknames. Okay. What are some of the other nicknames? Uh, Prune. It's a family nickname. Okay. I heard his family call him. I called him Start. Call him on that, too. Got on a joke and playing with him. Anything else? That's all I can remember. Uh-huh. And do you see um, Jeffrey Williams in the courtroom today? Yeah. Okay. Can you identify him by article of clothing he is wearing? I will stipulate that Mr. Murphy identifies him. All right, it's your style. The record will reflect. Thank you. Now, you said that you had met his family first and then you met him. Do you remember the circumstances of how you <coughs> met um, Mr. Williams? I can't really remember, man. <laughs> you asked me to think about a long, long time ago. You know how much I've been through since then? Yeah. Have you been through a lot? Tremendously. And we're going to talk about some of those things over the course of this time together. Yeah, I don't remember my first encounter. Oh. What was your relationship like with Mr. Williams when you all were younger? I mean, in any relationship, just like any other friends, you're young, you just want to have fun. What type of things did y'all do together to have fun? Um, um, one of our biggest things was listening to music. The dice music. What kind of music would y'all listen to? All kinds. All genre, genres, or however you pronounce that word. And would you do this at your home, his home, or somewhere else? Everywhere we go. As your relationship developed with Mr. Williams, did your relationship with any of his family members develop? I understand what you what you asking. Sure. You and Mr. Um, Williams have been friends since childhood. As you all continued your relationship and your friendship, did you grow your relationship with any of his other family members? His mom, his dad, any of his siblings? Yeah. Okay. My mama called him son. His mama called me son. What about um, his dad? Did you have a relationship with his father? Um, we were cool. I ain't never really just... I ain't never had my dad, so you feel me? I ain't really good with authority. 
But we was cool. I respected him. He respected me. Did you ever look to his father as a father figure for you? No. And then what about his siblings? Did you ever develop a relationship with any of his siblings? Yeah. Okay. Who? All of them. Mm -hmm. And how many siblings does he have? Two men in the count. Mm -hmm. Does he have a sister by the name of Dolly? Yeah. Did you have a relationship with, a friendship with Dolly? Yeah. And did he have a sister named Dora? Yeah. Did you have a friendship or relationship with his sister Dora? Yeah. Okay. Or all his siblings, not just them. Did you and Mr. Woods ever go to school together? I think we went to the alternative school at the same time. I ain't sure. And did the two of you ever do any recreational activities? I mean, sports or anything like that? Did you play on any sports teams together or anything of that nature? I never played sports. What is your current relationship with Mr. Williams? I don't have a relationship with him. When did that relationship cease? It, it never ceased. It's just I went to prison. And while, while you were in prison, you did not maintain your relationship or friendship? When you were in prison, you don't retain no relationship. All that in. And since you got out of prison, did you not rekindle your friendship when you, when you got out of prison? I had impor more important relationships to worry about than friends. Like my kids. <clears throat> Permission to approach? As long as you've shown that to the defense counsel already. Yes, Sean, I believe they all have it on the PowerPoint. I'm going to show you what's been Marcus State's Exhibit 3, Charlie Charlie. Do you recognize the individuals inside of State's Exhibit 3, Charlie Charlie? Yeah. Um, and how do you recognize the people in the picture? It's me. Okay. Is that a fair and accurate depiction of you in that picture? Yeah. Does it look like you? Yeah. Is there anyone else in that picture? Yeah. Okay. And does it look like that person who was in the picture? Yeah. Okay. Your Honor, at this time, State would like to tender State's Exhibit 3, Charlie Charlie, into evidence. Any objections to State's 3, Charlie Charlie? All right. State's 3, Charlie Charlie is admitted and may be published as you see fit. Now, looking at Stacey Exhibit 3, Charlie, Charlie, um, who's in the picture? Me. And who else? Little Jeff. All right. And in looking at that picture, do you recall when that picture was taken? No. Okay. Is it before you went to prison, um, either in 2014 or 2015? Yeah. 